Hey everybody, it's Rob from Flail Throughs. This is Armored Core 6, Fires of Rubicon. Thank you once again to uh, Bandai Namco Entertainment America for hooking me up with a copy of this. I bet you thought I'd forget again, didn't you? Well, you're right. It is Friday night, and I was just kind of uh, having an uh, antisocial evening and just kind of keeping to myself, and I realized... I haven't done this yet, and I probably ought to do it now. So we're going to start today by going to the arena, because um, I've unlocked, what, four more fights? We're going to do those for today and uh, see what I can get out of it. I may have to go back, I suspect, my quad build, just because this build was very, very uh, uh, specifically set up to uh, take down that boss. But uh, I'm pr I'm gonna try it first anyway and see what happens because why not? It's not a, it's not a bad build all around so just you know find out what we got. Okay, and I am probably gonna be rusty because it has been a couple of weeks. So don't be surprised if all the progress I've made in actually knowing what I'm doing goes directly out the window. But you know I will do my best as always. Let's see, it looks like got a shotgun and a machine gun. And good color scheme too. Looks nice. Like very uh very Iron Man-ish actually, but let's see. Now Alright. Here we go. Lock on time. And locked on. And might want to dodge, yes. Okay, missiles are going out. Okay, fell a little short of that because I forgot that I have to do this to use my pulse gun. Which I still haven't done correctly. It is just left on the D-pad, correct? One day, oh well, at least I landed something. Oh Rob, you are doing so good here. Missiles for you. Isn't it just... I know the thing's there. No? That's scan. Correct me if I'm wrong, I thought uh, switching weapons was just left on the D-pad, but it is not switching my weapons for me. Well, that's not the worst news. I'm still actually connecting with things, and I may actually win if I'm paying attention. Okay. More missiles. More gun. Now, I'm doing this with the sound off, to be honest, because I just, uh, been a long day and I fully expect I'd have a headache if I were to put on headphones. Oh yeah, no repair kits. This is the arena. So, my usual sloppiness will just get me killed here instead of cost me money. Let's see. The missiles are working well. No, it's the shoulder button, Rob, that switches it. Left, I believe, has to do with purging weapons, if you want to do that. Um, tag them. Good. Two, three. Looks like a good time to try again. And thank you, target lock break. I appreciate you. You are valued by someone. Got him. Okay, well, that was incredibly sloppy and... Not great, but I did it, so we'll, you know, we'll roll with that and move on to the next one and hope I'm a little bit more, uh, solid on that. Program complete. Alright. Okay. I'm now ranked 26. And two OST chips. And I can build that AC if I want to. And I've got its, uh, emblem, so... Okay, so basically, if I beat somebody, I apparently get the right to steal their identity. That's fair. To makes total sense. Okay, 25th, Materlink, 6th Squad Leader of the Vespers. Okay, Generation 8. Okay, so that's how far we've gotten with Cyber New Types, apparently. Let's see. Alright, let's see what we get. See if I can be a little bit more uh, coordinated here. Now that I remember the buttons I need to uh, actually use, that will help. 
Uh, I'm not saying I'm going to be a genius at this, but I will probably make it through at least. So. Okay. And... I do wish there was a way to have, like, target lock be the default mode. That would be nice. Because, like... It does tend to be the first thing that I need to uh, activate. Okay, you've got a bubble gun too. Here's mine. Target lock. I'm asking you nicely. Target lock. Let's switch back to sword and sword and some things, hopefully. Bam. There we go. Okay, let's just go in again. If it would let me. Oh, did I get stunned? I bet I got stunned. Locked on again. Charging in. Yeah, this one I'm gonna lose. At least on the first try. There will be more tries. I don't know at the moment if my other build would be any better at this. I really don't. I'm dead. Okay, can I just restart program? Yes, I can. Alright, let's try this again. Yeah, I'll give it like three tries with this build and then go and then give the quad a, a shot. Target lock on. Charge ready. Connected to some of it. Need to dodge more. To be honest, I'm not really sure what the best way to dodge the bubble gun is yet. I know it's not actually that, it's a plasma machine gun, but bubble gun. We'll just we'll just blow bubbles at each other here, like all night. It, it'll be fun. Uh, pulse rifle. Okay, good, good. Okay, it seems like the best thing to do Ow. is just assault boost in and stab, because if you can connect, that is an if. A fairly substantial if. It does massive damage. Like that. Okay, again, sloppy, but I made it through. Only the second try. I'll take that. And yeah. Okay. So yeah, I think I've basically remembered almost everything I need to remember to uh, make this work at this point, so that's hooray. Also, I don't think the purge thing works unless I have uh, the manual purge skill, which I have not purchased, so... Uh, two more OST chips. AC data acquired. I have stolen their uh, uh, mosquito-themed guitar pick. And we are going to move on to the next uh, one, which is 24, which, yeah, I think, uh, oh, little Z, uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the uh, person I already killed, so uh, we will uh, give this another try. I'm probably going to stick with this build until I hit a wall where I need to rebuild, because I'm not really sure what direction I want to take it in next, so I'll probably base it on what, you know, whatever situation I need to uh, get through. But we will, uh, we'll see about that as we go. Okay, that thing just looks like a gigantic toolbox. I kind of like it. There is a, uh, there is a, a Transformer in Transformers Energon whose name is Padlock. And for the life of me, I always want to make the name Toolshed. I don't know why. Probably because you would put a padlock on a tool shed generally, but uh, boom. oops, only one, only one saber. I I think that was the charged attack. We'll we'll pretend it was. And boom. nope, okay. And more charged fire. Boom. I keep saying boom. I should stop saying boom. If I'm gonna say boom, that's when you say boom. When there's actually something. You know, booming. But... Okay, good. Good. Have some missiles, maybe. Yep. Okay. Big swing. 
Big, big swing missed. That is not atypical. Boom. That big swing hit, that was worthy of boom. And I think I can just finish this off with, yep, the rifle. Okay, yeah, I don't think I took a lot of damage on that one. No, I really didn't, so... Okay, yeah, that's, uh, I, I think I'm getting my, uh, getting my, uh, coordination back here a little bit for this, so. Let's see. Yep, verified. Two more OST chips. AC data acquired. I, ha I have stolen her fish. Okay. Killed her and stole her fish. Very rude. Um, let's see. And I think there's one more arena fight. Yep, Swinburne, who is another one of the uh, Vespers. Generation 7 Cyber New Type, okay. Well, let's see what that amounts to. And from the description, seems to be a real jerk, but... I'm just going to assume that the, uh, you know... The elite team of uh, of cyber new types is going to be mostly jerks because that's just you know that is the trope. And uh, okay, uh, ah, one of the things I uh, you know, one of the things I think about sometime that uh, icon reminded me is of course. For years, especially when I was younger, they believed that the ancient Egyptians had a uh, hook tool to pull the uh, that they somehow used to pull the entire brain out for the purpose uh, for mummifying things. Um, we have figured out since, of course, that uh, that's not what they did. Uh, that was not so much a pulling tool as a uh, blending tool. Yeah. Trying not to get too gross with it, but yeah, that's how that worked, actually. So, big swing. Did it connect? Who knows? Well, thinking no. But, yeah, the just the... Uh, his logo, which I think is showing trepanation, is uh, just kind of put me in mind of that. Okay, good. And now missiles and gun and gun and missiles and yeah I'm definitely I'm not in the lead here but there is a possibility I just need to pay a little bit more attention when there's gigantic missiles coming at my face I am not paying attention to the face missiles it's bad I'm too close I'm gonna charge right through the missiles and jump and dead yeah those have uh, I gotta get I have to dodge that more Precisely because that has a big AoE and I don't want to be sitting in it. Okay, see if I can actually pay attention here. Stop telling gross brain stories and uh, actually fight. Unfortunately, firing of course pulled you in place. So, now, now, there we go. Charging, firing, charging and firing, and dodging, and boom. Good, that was a good boom. Okay, and we shoot things. And I'm just about out of boost, and so far away my lock broke, so that didn't work. Ooh, big missile! Okay, yeah. Yeah. Ah, it's it's amazing how much better I can do with this when I'm not. Tr Ow! Never mind. When I'm not trying to talk at the same time, he said while talking and getting killed. So it's time to stop that. Please. Yep, I got hit by the big missile, and now I'm probably gonna die. my attacks and I am interrupting yours.
I'm dead. Let's try that one more time. I was getting close, and if I hadn't made a couple of mistakes there, I think I'd have it. So let's have it. Lock on, skates on. Big missile. Should have dodged faster and differently. Should have jumped. One, two. Not enough to stun. Not quite. Big missile. I am just not prepared for those big missiles. I'm apparently not prepared for any missiles, but you know. Come stunned. One, two. That was pretty good. I'm nearly dead. Ow. You're not supposed to retaliate. That's rude. Pulse missiles. Charge again foolishly and dead again. I can get this. I'm just... Pardon me as I adjust in my chair and make old man noises. Yeah, I got this. It'll just take a few tries. I, to be honest, as much uh, uh, as the uh, missiles are the problem here, I don't really see the... Whoa! I don't really see the uh, uh, other build as being a an improvement. So. One thing is that this does, in case, in case you don't know this, if, in case you have not... Uh, uh, encountered this because you don't mash buttons as much as I do. Um, this does buffer input, so if you tap square twice, you will dodge twice. So, I'm not good at precision, honestly. I, I rarely have been. Can I get in there? One. 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 Dodging now, please. Thank you. Bad. Can I land enough shots to stun his face and then stab him in it? Yes. One, two. Missiles out. Dodge. Ow. Not bad. Missiles free. Okay, yeah. This is why I uh, this is why I narrated Baltius fight after the fact because, as you can see, I play a lot better when I don't have to talk at the same time. So apologies for the quiet, but the quiet was necessary, or we all would have been here all day. But okay, that is rank twenty three, and I have uh, gotten two more chips and stolen his trepanation guitar pick. Cool. Um, or maybe that is the ancient Egyptian tool I'm thinking of. Who knows? But... Enough enough talking about that. Uh, notification. Okay, notify me. Incoming comms. Do not press buttons or I will accidentally uh, uh, skip past things. I have surpassed rank E. Hooray! I'm sure the next rank will be... Uh, Locked down until after I've uh, advanced the game a little further. All mind exists for all mercenaries. Okay, well, and all mercenaries exist for you know stabbiness for hire. So, all right, let's see. I've got the boost kick. I forgot I have the boost kick. I need to be using the boost kick. Have the weapon bay. Um, yeah, that's the manual purge. I don't think so. Manual aiming allows for manual reticle control, but practical usage calls for experience technique. Haha, <laughs> no. Um, quick turn. Okay, that's basically the qu kind of quick turn that uh, you get in space, except a lot more uh, practical. That might be worthwhile. I have to think about it. Assault armor. Um, 
Assault armor creates a pulse explosion centered on the AC. Uh, canceling out incoming enemy fire and creating a damaging area of effect shockwave. L3 and triangle to, un to use that. And that's one chip to have. That's a temptation. Uh, pulse protection. Pulse barrier in a fixed position, providing cover from enemy fire until barrier reaches its durability or time limit. So if I wanted a shield, I could have a shield. Pulse armor creates a pulse barrier that trails the AC, dramatically increasing defensive performance until it exceeds durability or time limit. Okay, so... Uh, terminal armor. Terminal armor automatically triggers a pulse barrier when the AP sees AP reaches its limit, greatly enhancing defense until the barrier reaches durability or time limit. Activates automatically when AP uh, falls to zero. Okay, but I thought zero equaled explode. Um, let's see, fire control tuning for kinetics. Uh, fire control uh, for uh, explosive damage. Fire control for energy weapons. Fire control for melee weapons. Hmm. Let's see. Damage tuning. Precision of attacks against staggered enemies. That's a temptation, isn't it? Uh, speed optimization. Access. Oh, access speed. Yeah, I'm not going to need that, because almost any time I've been needed to access something, I've basically needed... I've basically had empty space or been able to clear the area first, so... Um... Okay, well, I think I'm going to go for damage reduction, because I think I need it. I don't think I'll take it all the way up to the tree. I can't afford to, anyway. Um, let's see. I'm really kind of tempted to do the damage bonus against staggered enemies. But... Also t kind of tempted by the melee damage, because melee seems to be, like, the most damaging thing you can do, so upping that damage would be useful. There's a lot of options, and I'm not sure which way to jump yet. Um, quick turn does sound handy, but I don't remember to use all the mobility options I have now, so I'll probably hold on that. Um... Assault armor, pulse protection, pulse armor. Looks, since they're all L3 and triangle, I'm assuming you can only have one at a time. Uh, let's see. I'm just trying to figure out what would be best. Um, pulse barrier that trails the AC. Hmm. Um, terminal armor, I don't think I'll go for. Um... Let's see. I have six. I think I'm going to go for the pulse armor. Okay, five to get an additional charge of it. And I'm going to get... I'm going to do the melee upgrade. Yeah. I can always... Uh, as far as I know, I can always reset these and try again. But uh, I think that will work for now. Yeah, and that's my limit for arena fighting for now. So, all right. That is going to do it for this episode of Armored Core 6. We will be back soon with more. Till next time, everybody take care and have fun. Later!